railway construction project, we are lacking of transportation for material resources and labour resources. Construction materials might need to be transported from point to point since the material suppliers will put the materials at a fixed place only. In addition, the highway project is high demand on manpower resources for instance construction levels and equipment operators. Huge number of manpower might need transportation to work from place to place. Therefore, our company is lacking one ton lorry and double cab light pickup truck for those tra transportation currently. Our source of information are from RHB Bank Consultancy and Car Dealer, where Rishal Khan is the RHB banker and Jeff Yu is Toyota dealer. We obtain information about the interest rate and service cost of vehicle, and all the information were analyzed in the further part. The analysis is being divided into three phases, namely acquisition phase, operational phase, and end of life. For acquisition phase, there are three periods divided into needs of assessment, conceptual design, and detailed design. The first step of the analysis is to determine the deposit. By using 10% of deposit, the deposit for each vehicle is as shown here. Next is to calculate the monthly payment and annual payment. The monthly payment and annual payment is calculated by using this formula. For the interest rate of car, the interest rate is different according to different type of bank. By taking account the advice from expertise who works at local bank, the interest rate we use is as shown here. Hence, the annual payment for each vehicle is as shown here. The operation phase. The operation phase covers the largest phase in the project life cycle. In this phase, we should consider two aspects. First, periodic maintenance costs, and the second is fuel consumption and operation costs. In periodic maintenance costs, we need regular car maintenance to keep car running smoothly and reduce the car problem. The cost normally depends on vehicle itself. We are getting the service cost from car manufacturer websites. Assuming the total distance travel is 7,800 km per year, the service cost for each vehicle is calculated and tabulated in table. Fuel consumption and operation cost we assuming the zero price remain at two ringgit and eighty cents per liter for next five years. Then we calculate the petrol cost each year and then tablet in the table. Service cost were calculated by refer to the actual information obtained from the market. In this project, the data is corrected and the. The new buying price in 2014 and the selling price in 2019 was corrected from the website. To calculate the seven cost, the, fol the following formula was using. For the result, the higher depreciation in one ton lorry is Hino 300 series. It is among 53.4% and the lower depreciation value is about 20% for the Isuzu if and for the category double cap line pickup trust the higher depreciation is the Nissan Navara which is among 56.96% and the lower depreciation value is 32.16% for the Toyota Hilux. Next, for the MPW value, the discrete compound interest factor are used to calculate. And in, in category 1 ton lorry, Isuzu if have the lower MPW value and the higher MPW value is the Hino 300 series. For category 
double cap line pickup trash. The lowest MPW is Toyota Hilux and the highest is the Nissan Navara. As the conclusion, the Isuzu if with the lower MPW value is suitable to buy in this project. Why for the category double cap line pickup trash, the Toyota Hilux is the best choice to buy in this project.